Yo, yo, what's going on everybody? We are uh, just getting the bike warmed up before we head out on the track for the first time. This is my new KTM two-stroke. And this will be my first time ever out on a motocross track with a two-stroke. So I'm a little bit, uh, a little bit nervous. But I think she's pretty warm. See how we do out there, huh? At least it's soft. Yeah, it's soft, right? <sighs> this is a hard one. Oh! This is a hard turn. Oh! Jeez. Oh. This thing is hard to ride on a sand track, man. Holy cow. This is my first first motocross track ride on a two-stroke literally ever in my life I wanted to pull over and talk a little bit about how I feel about this specific bike and just the two-stroke in general I'm not super familiar with this track I've been here once maybe maybe twice before but it's been like over the span of I don't know two maybe three years and it's a super deep sand track so this thing the one main thing i've noticed over my 250f is if i get the wrong gear in a corner and i 
you know, I don't have that power and I like let go of it in the corner a little bit and I'm not ready to use that clutch or downshift, I just like come to a dead stop. It's just, there's nothing left. Where on the four stroke, you know, you can pretty much torque and power through anything. So that's one thing I noticed. But overall, it is incredible. But I definitely think this KTM corners, for me, for my experience, this corner is better than my KX250 did. I know I have some like European followers that are gonna say this sand track is nothing. The camera probably doesn't do it justice, but these ruts in front of me, these ruts are like at least eight inches, nine inches, 10 inches deep here. And the sand is pretty much all, the entire track is pretty much all like that deep, so. This is gnarly for me, man. Oh yeah, hitting those corners way better now. absolutely spent exhausted we did trail riding we did a bunch of motocross riding on this super gnarly rutted deep sand track so i'm gonna call it a day overall i mean I, I don't know if i can say anything bad about it i know that the one thing i mentioned earlier was the power you just got to be so used to popping that clutch or downshifting like if you stuff it in some deep sand so you don't come to a dead stop, you gotta be ready to use that power in a lower gear with that clutch. But I don't think that's a downside. I think that's just learning how to ride a 125, 150. This is a KTM 125 with the uh, 150 cylinder and piston on it. So, you know, it's essentially a 150. But it corners like, like a freaking dream, man. I feel much more confident in the corners on this than I did on my KX. First ride on a motocross track on a two-stroke bike in general absolutely love it love the decision 10 out of freaking 10 this thing is amazing if you're if you want to go buy a, if you're thinking about buying a ktm 125 or a ktm 150 i just say go ahead and do it <laughs> don't look back don't think about it just do it you're gonna love it you're gonna have a blast but thank you guys so much for watching i appreciate it if you made it this far in the video if you don't mind hitting that thumbs up button that would be great and if you want to see more content on my new KTM, feel free to click that subscribe button and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.